I, I think the story of hemp is just getting started, but it will have a very important role to play in the story of how we restore and regenerate our planet. Did you know that hemp is one of the best plants to take carbon out of the air and put it back into the soil? This is a hemp story. This is a carbon story. It's a story about our environment. It's a story about our planet. We've caused tremendous damage to this planet, not just by human activity, but, but human activity has contributed significantly to the damage that's been done here. It manifests itself in the rising temperature. That's how we all feel it. That's, what's, that's what we're gonna know is the, the real consequence. I am committed to driving a business that, that its core focus is on the regeneration of the planet. That starts primarily for us, you can look at the soil. We've depleted the soil on the face of the earth. We've caused incredible damage. We've, called, we've caused desertification. We have deserts everywhere now. Um, and so from us, the lens that we look at Santa Fe Farms, as we look at what we do, is what we can do to help regenerate the planet. And that's why that word is so important to us. It's really a land regeneration story. It's all about bringing CO2 from the atmosphere where it's causing problems, bring it back down into the soil. And if we do that using what are called nature-based solutions, we can rebalance carbon cycles globally, restore climate stability, and in fact, restore the fertility of the earth. You bring the CO2 back into the earth, it makes ecosystems happier. The real importance that we're now recognizing is that in a world where we're concerned about the heating of our planet, um, it is a very effective purveyor of photosynthesis. It converts CO2 into oxygen and carbon. It stores that carbon in its roots. And so in a world where we're now thinking that they're gonna be natural sinks that are important to help um, keep us from heating up the planet, hemp I think is gonna play an extraordinarily important agricultural role on top of all of its other uses, but in the sequestration of carbon. What's the relationship between hemp and carbon? Hemp is able to grow very, very quickly, build very deep roots, and suck that CO2 out of the atmosphere, put it into its own plant structure, deep down into its roots, where it's engaging in complex ecological relationships with fungi and microbes and critters of all kinds, and that carbon goes right there into the soil. So it's sequestering, it's storing soil, very, very quickly, more than virtually any other plant. Then of course, there's the plant itself. It's a unique plant because of the nature, how much cellulose it has. And it turns out that if you treat it correctly and build things, it will continue to sequester carbon long past after it's been harvested. So one of the things that we're looking at is the development of building products that actively sequester carbon for as much as 100 years in their capacity, making up the sides of buildings. So carbon is, in every aspect of where we're looking in our business. One of the things that we're gonna find over the next 25 years is that um, the trading of carbon offsets and carbon credits will become one of the major, major trading um, activities in the world, probably next to interest rates. So there's going to be a market in helping people offset their polluting, their use of carbon, um, by helping regenerate the planet by having carbon sinks. We've got a 50 gigaton problem of CO2 that we need to address. And I think we need to do that collectively. And so, like I said, I think hemp is a great vehicle for this. I think it is something we can all embrace, not just as consumers, but also as producers. We know it's gonna be a multi, multi hundred billion dollar marketplace of the trading. We think hemp has a unique role to play in that. And that because of the characteristics it has, because of the amount of carbon it sequesters, that we believe that we can become one of the major originators of these credits and offsets. Um, and we're really excited. We're gonna devote a lot of resource to that because that's good for the planet and good for shareholders. If not us, who? If not now, when? We're in a prime position to generate carbon offsets. An industry has finally woken up and realized we're at a tipping point. To me, that's what Santa Fe Farms has done. It has put that stake out there. It has made that big, bold statement and saying, we are going to be leading this industrial hemp revolution. At Santa Fe Farms, we are literally growing carbon offsets and making an impact. This is a story where we work with industry to save the planet. Mm -hmm.